Hi guys, it's Moz here and today we're going to be doing a bit of a series on building this Tiger One starter set from Airfix. These were for sale in the local Audi or Lidl, so whichever one you bought it from, this will be what you get inside the box. So this will be the unboxing video today and later on we'll do a building video and then a painting video afterwards so the unboxing of this kit so we're going to see what you get inside the box that's basically what i do with these unboxings at first you can see you've got a really good box art there of the tank you're going to be building german symbols on there because it is a world war ii tank inside the box you will get three acrylic paints one brush and one tube of poly cement on the back of the box you have what we call a call out which basically tells you the size of the of the kit, the colour it's going to be, and it also tells you where the decals or the water transfers will be placed on the model. The side of the box always has some information, the history of the tank, including the length, the width, and this particular kit here has 39 pieces. It's classed as a skill level one, so it shouldn't take too much to build, and these flying hours is a little marketing technique from Airfix where you can become a member of their club. I will leave details for this club in the description and you can collect these flying hours and you can then use these flying hours to get other kits for free, not including the postage and packaging, obviously. So straight off, let's have a look at what you get inside the box. So this is what you get inside the box. You will get a bag full of parts, which we call sprues. And on the sprues are the parts that you need to build the kit. You will get a bag of paints in little tubs or little pots, and you will get a tub of poly cement. Now we call this glue, but it's not really a glue. What happens is this liquid inside the tube basically when you put it on the plastic what it does it creates an endothermic reaction which means it heats up the plastic and then melts it and welds it together and then when it's dry it creates a bond so that's how this poly cement works remember use it liberally when you're building a model you also get inside the pack uh, a Humbro number no. two paintbrush, and this is for painting and not to be used with the cement. Take away this protective film here, you have what we call the decals or decals, depending on who you speak to. And they are basically water transfers. What you're gonna be doing is once you've painted the model, you, you cut the decals on the card, then you soak this in water. And what happens is the transfer will come loose off the backing card and you then slide them into position on the model. Very easy to use and I'll show you how to use these in the build video. You also get inside the kit this instruction manual and basically it's a step-by-step -step guide on how to build your Tiger One. And you'll see that it is full of instructions on how to build the model. And as we progress, we will show you how to use the instructions. What's missing, sadly, in these start sets from Audi and Lidl, Airfix have created a before you start guide. This one here. And basically, it's a sheet with some very good tips on how to build a model. And what I have done is I've scanned this sheet and I've put it as a link in the description. So you can then click that link and you will see a PDF file and you can print that PDF file of this sheet and it will help you as you start building this Tiger One tank. The link is in the description box below. Let's open the bag here of sprues and let's just see what we get. And there you are, you have three sprues. Each are lettered and numbered so you will know where to find the part. This one here is frame A. And as you can see, there's little tabs with numbers on. So you'll be able to find the part that you need. This is basically the belly of the tank, the skirts, the top, and you can see there's some intricate detail or some tools on here. So that will be frame A. 
To be fair, it's pretty sharp. It's a, it's a new tool and it's only two years old. So you shouldn't have any problems with this kit. This one is frame B. There you go, frame B. And they're also numbered as well. You can see the little numbers there, 15, 16, 17, 18. And uh, this is mostly the turret. As you can see, some lovely fine detail there. And finally, we have frame C, which is the gearing. So no need to go worrying about uh, if you've built kits before and you've had to uh, cement the tracks and the wheels in or the, or the or the running gear there's no need this comes as uh, basically one piece and all you do is you can actually paint this before you attach it to the model it makes it easier so you can paint the gray of the tracking and then also the gear and you can paint the color that says what is said in the instructions basically you snip these off with the screw cutters and then glue them together and then you glue that piece onto the model so there you go that was a little unboxing of the airfix starter set the 172 scale tiger one in the next video we will go on to build this kit so keep an eye out by clicking the subscribe button click the bell select all and you'll be notified when i release the next video thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video cheers